I was a kid who was on punishment the entire middle school. I stayed on punishment. Getting in trouble in school, missing curfews, not doing homework, I stayed in trouble. Miss Atlas put me in a band, she gave me a trumpet. So I played the trumpet, it was whatever. And by the end of middle school, all the kids in the district were going to the district high school. When my sisters had gone, everybody before us had gone, I'm ready to go. It's like the rite of passage, West Roxbury High School. Then Miss Ellis came to me, she said, um, I'm sending you to another school. I said, for what? Everybody goes to Westie. She said, no, you have a gift. So what are you talking about? She said, you're a gifted musician, Andre. I'm gonna send you to this other school, it's a magnet school that has a great music program. And I was like, no, I wanna go with my friends. She said, no, you're going where your gift goes. You need new friends who play music. So she makes me go to the magnet school. So I go to the new school, high school. I'm there all by myself, go into the band room. I'm kind of thugged out. <laughs> and there's a room full of nerds. All these little nerdy kids holding clarinets and trombones, and I got my little trumpet. But like real musicians, they just want to know, could I play mine? So I took the trumpet out, hit Star Wars, hit Rocky, you know what I'm saying, no sheet music necessarily. They're like, you're one of us. <laughs> so in the morning, I'd hang out in the band with the band kids. Then in the afternoon, I'm hanging out with the thug kids. And that was my kind of like my routine. And after probably like a month or so, the thug kids are like, Dre, what's that box you're carrying? What's my trumpet? Man, that thing's stupid. You need to get rid of it. We're sneaking in the stores. We're sneaking on the buses. They're like, you need to get rid of that thing. It's like drawing too much attention. So it was either the trumpet or my friends. I've been alone since I was a little kid. Grew up in a house full of people, but I was alone. So in the end, I gave up my trumpet. And I tell people, growing up poor is horrible. But tons of people have grown up poor and made it. Growing up without a dad, don't wish it on anybody. Lots of people have grown up without a dad and made it. But growing up without a dream is impossible. If you don't have a dream slash your purpose, you're going no place fast.